Summer means getting outside and enjoying the sun, maybe a cool adult beverage, but when you're traveling, the fun doesn't have to stop because our friends at HMS Host are always working to create the perfect beverage to pair with your flight. I met Thor and Carson to talk about and taste some of what you can expect. I don't know about you, but when you say the summer, I think adult beverage, but I also like to enjoy adult beverages when I travel. I'm here at the HMS Host Test Bar with my friends Thor and Carson. Thank you so much for having me. Thanks for having us today. So one of the first things I think of when I travel is Bloody Mary, and I hear you make a mean Bloody Mary. We can, absolutely. I'll get going on that for you right now. All right, thank you. And while he's making that, I have to ask you, you can find different beverages at airports all around the country. From the staple Bloody Marys to what else? Well, I'll tell you what's really trending these days in airport bars and restaurants from an adult beverage perspective. One is craft beer. Yeah. There's a, been a massive movement into craft beer, both local and regional breweries. Mm -hmm. And when you go into your local airport, it's very easy for you to, sign, to find a sense of place with your local crafts. Yeah and it gives the traveler an opportunity to experience a lot of different flavors and brands and styles of beers, and it's really, really gaining traction throughout. Yeah, you know, I think that that's something a lot of travelers don't think about, you know, and that is something that HMS Host is doing really well. If you're just on a layover in an airport, you can actually get a taste of the local flavor in the airport alone. You can get something unique food-wise, but you can also experience a local beer. So from what I understand, you have a proprietary blend of a Bloody Mary mix. Uh, you know, our guests wanted something with a little bit more kind of, um, you know, a little more oomph to it, a little more smoke, maybe a touch more heat. Uh, so we've worked uh, with, this, um, with our partners and it's called Element uh, Bloody Mary Elixir, and it's uh, batch number 12. And that's because on the 12th batch, or the recipe, okay. um, we got it correct. So, do I get to try this? <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> and while I'm trying this, I, my next question to you, Thor, would be, what's trending in cocktails? Yeah. As we move into the summer months, what you really see trending in cocktails uh, especially in airports, is, is, mar is margarita. Uh, that's my go-to. And uh, it's one of our uh, second most popular drinks. And today, Carson's making our take on a margarita, which is called a doborita. Okay. Well, we wanted to use a premium tequila like uh, Thor was mentioning, so we use the Maestro de Bell. We make our own uh, in-house uh, fresh sour mix, which is a mixture of fresh squeezed lime, lemon, a little bit of sweetness. Uh, and then we add a touch of uh, orange juice in there to, uh, as well, and then some fresh uh, agave nectar. So more of a premium standpoint for that very popular cocktail that okay. uh, keeps, uh, keeps those travelers happy. And while he's finishing that, I also noticed that there's no straw in the drinks. Yes, there is no straw. So initially we eliminated all cocktail stirs, which were the small plastic yep, straws, yep, out of all of our bars and restaurants. Um, that serve adult beverage, which is over 400 locations throughout North America. There you go. Thank you. Again, Enjoy. no straw. I like it. Cheers. And you have your choice of salt or no salt. We just salt about half the rim there for you. Thank you. Oh, this is delicious. There you go. You can, act, you can taste the orange juice. There you go. Fresh squeeze. 